In Madden 25, mobile quarterbacks are one of the most effective weapons in Madden 25, and they cause problems like this right here. Uh, as you see, one of the biggest glitches in the game this year is the quarterback wrap, in my opinion. A lot of people are having trouble stopping it, but in today's video, today's this week's episode one of how to tip of the week, we're going to talk about how to stop quarterback wrap, and you can actually do it out of any formation in Madden NFL 25. All right, guys. Quarterback rap. One of the biggest. Uh, my name is Cody Ballard. For those of you who don't know my name, uh, and I make YouTube videos about Madden 25. I post them on the internet, and some people like them for some reason. I don't know. I'm just a great guy. I don't know what this is, but uh, a lot of people like them, and uh, it, you know, it's just an opportunity I get to share my content, and and hopefully you guys like it. So let's see if we can teach you how to stop quarterback rap. Doesn't matter what play you're going to come out in. Uh, but for this example, we are going to come out in one of the best defenses in the game this year. The 46 normal cover three. And you're going to see what's going to happen on this play is the quarterback wrap. If we, we're just going to come out, we're going to set it up. So we're going to set up one of our basic looks. And we're just going to, you know, do what our do what we do here out of the 46 normal. I mean, those of you who checked out last week's scheme of the week, you know exactly what this play is. And this is one of the popular plays we do. But you're going to see quarterback wrap is just going to absolutely torch it. And there's nothing we can do. You see Robert Griffin is going to be gone 100% of the time. Um, literally, we're going to run this three times here and I want to show you exactly how effective the quarterback wrap is in Madden 25 so we set up our play this is our base play out of the cover three snap go and you see again Robert Griffin touchdown so two touchdowns in a row in practice mode and, and then the first one earlier and then we're going to do it one more time now we're not going to do anything at all to the play and you see it's going to break up the middle. That didn't break for a touchdown just because Robert Griffin was an idiot and ran it inside. I want to see if I can get him to break it again for a touchdown. There it goes. Yep, he's gone. Yep, and you see again, touchdown. So out of the four times we ran the quarterback wrap, three of them were, were ran for touchdowns. But I'm going to tell you today, you can stop it with one simple technique. Okay, what we like to do in this situation is we like to... Uh, out of our 46 normal, we always like to baseline and show blitz just because that's how we like to run the defense as a whole. We then like to spread the defensive line. If we're running our cover three base, we're going to quarterback spy the defensive tackle. Purple zones on the outside here, and we're going to use her with the safety. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about or you, miss, you, you need some help uh, in terms of figuring out what I'm saying, check out the defensive terminology video or just the beginner tips uh, playlist that should be in the description. Uh, if not in this video, in every video after this. So be sure to check that out. All right, and then what we're going to do is we're going to do one simple step. We're going to hit L2 or left trigger on Xbox. It's going to bring up this menu. You can see that we can have we have the choice to uh, option play quarterback, option play running back. We can shift the defense, spread, shift left, shift right, pinch. We could guess the play, pass, run left, run right, run middle. What I want you guys to focus on is the guess play, and I want you to hit the pass commit, or the pass. Uh, we want to guess pass, so that means we're going to flick the right analog stick up, and we're going to guess the pass, and take a look at what happens. And now you see RG3, and I mean, if it wasn't for that missed tackle in the backfield, you know, he would have been stopped to basically nothing on that on that run. And then if you, it's even better if you send, you know, some pressure out of him. So real quick, we'll set up just a basic. Like this concept isn't even going to get in, but we're going to show you. Pass commit, snap go, and now you see we're wrapping him up for a five-yard loss. And this is very effective, and it can be done over and over and over again. Pass commit again. And you're going to see it snap the ball. Now Robert Griffin's bottled up. All right. So that is, that is it out of the 46 normal formation. Now I want to show it to you out of the nickel normal formation. The nickel normal formation, if you guys don't know, is one of the uh, probably one of the most balanced formations in Madden in general. And I want to take a look at it real quick. So nickel normal, and we'll just call a play like two men under. I mean, that's just a basic play. Everybody knows two men under. It's one of the most effective plays every year. And uh, all we're going to do is we're going to we're just going to base a line just because we like to base a line every time. And then out of the 46 uh, or the nickel normal, I like to shift my linebackers to the right, and I like to spread my line just because that's my basic pressure concepts. All right. And then what I'll do is again, I like to use the middle linebacker, so I'm just him right here, and I'll back him up. Pass commit, and you're going to see it to snap at the ball. We are going to lock RG3 up, nowhere to go, and end up getting a one-yard gain. All right, so now we're going to go to the nickel 335. Uh, and we're going to set up our two-man under. So set up the play. Whoops. My dude here, where'd he go? There he is. 
Wheel him out. Oh, I guess he can't. That's weird. I'll just shut them there. Uh, pass commit again. And I see again, Robert Griffin 3, nowhere to go. Uh, slid 4 for like 3 yards. And I see this is, this is a lot better than the touchdowns we were giving up every single time. If you notice, he has not broken a touchdown one time since we uh, have gone to this defense. Again, just pass commit. And again at the snap at the ball. Now you see, uh, you know, just, just big time hits in the backfield. So that's how to stop the quarterback rapid man 25, guys. If you guys have any questions about it or any concerns with this type of defense or type of look, let me know in the comments below. I'll try to see what I can do for you. Uh, also, guys, be sure to check out some of my my buddies uh, on YouTube. They're really good. Uh, you guys think my content's good. You haven't even scratched the surface of what good content is. Check out Ryan Dykes' channel. Uh, he has a full 4-3 stack defensive guide up there, so you can check that out there. And then also, if you guys want to check out my man, Zboy365. Some of you guys may not know him. He's been on the YouTube scene for almost a full year now. He has about 6,000 subscribers. He should have about 60,000 subscribers for the amount of work this man puts into his content. Uh, be sure to check him out. He is partially the reason that some of my content actually looks somewhat decent. Uh, if it was my way, all of the videos would probably be laggy. As you guys saw, that one week I didn't wasn't able to contact him. All of my videos were poor quality. And uh, you see, I mean... I, it's like night and day my YouTube channel in terms of appearance without him. And uh, Zboy365 is, is one of my best friends by far in the Madden community. And uh, arguably one of the best players this year in the Madden community. So check him out. Uh, his channel is Madden Moments 365 uh, Or you can just type in Zboy365. It'll come up in the search box. It's also in the description. And it's also on my Featured Channels tab. And then also one other guy I wanted to shout out again. I wanted to give uh, Michael Riley another shout out. Remember, we're trying to get him to 1,000 subscribers in two weeks. And if you guys are on board with this, like I said, if you guys can, if I see that this guy gets 1,000 subscribers after two weeks, I will do a full uh, offensive guide. I'm not going to tell you what the guide's going to, the playbook's going to be on, but I'm going to tell you right now, it's 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 99% almost invincible. It is very effective in the game. It's very difficult to stop. And uh, it's gonna it's gonna get you guys that it's gonna give you the the formula the Krabby as Monster Chap would say the Krabby Patty formula of Mad 25. We're gonna talk about it. We're gonna break it down. I'm not gonna hold anything back from you, and uh, we're gonna give it to you. We're gonna give it to you for free. We're not gonna charge it. We're not gonna do anything because you guys did my man Michael. You're gonna do me. You're gonna do Z Boy. You're gonna do all of us a service, and we're gonna come together and we're gonna give you guys back something. So again, if you guys will just subscribe to Michael Riley and watch his content. I would really appreciate it. This man deserves a lot more subscribers than he has, and it's up to us to fix that problem. I really am appreciative of all the subscribers I've gotten the last couple of weeks, and I owe a lot of that sex success to Z-Boy and, and Gibbs and Falls and, and Ryan and all those guys. You know, they really have helped make me the gamer that I am, and I want to give them a shout-out. I want to see their channels grow as well. So thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you have any questions, let me know. If you're a new subscriber and looking for some more help at Mad25, don't hesitate to email me. Also, if you're a new subscriber and want some videos that you can look at, check out the beginner tips. It's a really good place to start. And also, if you really want to get some, really want to get deep, go back to the 4-3 free defensive guide I put out in Madden 13. Tell me what you think of it. Check it out. It's a longer guide. It's going to take you about you know maybe a couple days to get through it all. But it's probably one of the best guides in Madden 13. And I'm pretty sure that it can help your defense in Madden 25 because we talk about a lot of basic concepts that can get you on board and, and really effective defensively. So be sure to check that out, guys. And also check out those YouTube channels I talked about. Thank you guys so much for spending three minutes after the video listening to me talk. And I can't wait to see you guys tomorrow again. Really appreciate you guys watching. Now you guys know how to stop QB rap and those mobile quarterbacks from really being a problem in Madden 25. We'll see you guys tomorrow.